guys, I want to talk about who you take advice off and who you should take advice off. Now, don't want this to hit any nerves with anybody, you know, might be a little bit, might be a bit controversial for some people, but I think it is a reality or a conversation that you need to have with yourself. Okay, so the way I look at it, the way I look at this about taking advice from people, okay, we all take advice from family members, uh, especially our parents, our grandparents, our aunties, our uncles, our sisters, our brothers. You know, they're the closest people to us and our really close friends, okay? They're the people we take advice off automatically because we are connected with them. But are these the right people, okay? Now, the reason why I say this is because I want you to look, what I want you to do with your life and your goals and the ambitions that you've got is these people that are giving you advice, do they have something that you want, okay? Do they have a life that you want? If they do, if they have the life that you want, this person stood there is giving you advice on where to go in business, what to do with your money, how to spend your money, um, giving criticism on what, what is a good angle to go in business, what to do, what not to do. If you look at their life and what they have and you want exactly what they've got, then you take advice. If they don't, you'd be a bit stupid to take advice, right? And this is something that I think a lot of people find it hard to understand. I take advice I listen to everybody I've got I will listen to everybody and even my eight-year-old give me some advice on my makeup line and I took it on board because she had a bloody good idea she wanted me to do wood packaging instead of plastic I'm like damn right amazing girl I'm having that so I will listen to advice from everybody and I've got so much time for everybody however if it is if I've got ideas and what I want to do and how I want to live my life and where I want to spend my money and what goals I have and this person there is giving me advice that I haven't got that life, then I wouldn't take that advice. I'd listen, I'd be polite, but I would not take that advice on board because their advice that they're giving is to give me what they've got. And I don't, want the, I don't want what they've got. So why would I take their advice? So surround yourself and take advice from people who have got the life that you want. I am surrounded by so many people in the coaching programs that have made, have made their mark on being a coach, a business entrepreneur, a beauty entrepreneur, um, you know, a, the, living a financial free life all these people are giving me advice and I'm fucking taking it all because they have the life I want. They have exactly what I want. I want to be like them. So they're the people I take advice from. So I'm not saying be a bitch and just, you know, discount it. Listen to everybody. I've got time to listen and learn from everybody. But whether I take that advice on or not is reflected upon whether I want the life that they have or I don't. So think about that. Think about that when you are putting out there your goals, your dreams, your aspirations, what you want to do. Think about that person that's giving it back to you before you make a decision on what you're going to do. Okay? So go for it. <laughs> See ya.